Hello Sagittarius, how are you all today? This is going to be your um, August 2019 reading. It's a love reading. We're going to be seeing how your partner's feeling about you throughout the month of August, okay? So of course, if you need a personal reading from me, you can check out the link in the description below, okay? Um, my website is harleysworld13.com slash tarot. You'll be able to book a personal reading with me by going to my website. Also, if you want to try some of our new options, which are quicker and more efficient and they're cheaper, um, you can ch check out the email, pendulum, and romance oracle readings that are also listed in the link description, okay? Um, they, those are done by another reader, but I love her. She does my readings, and I think she's a very good reader. So if you want something like a different opinion, cheaper, faster, check her out. If not, you can definitely check out my website, okay? And I'll be happy to read your cards, all right, Sag? So, you have the Ace of Pentacles. Nice. That's a new card. I always think this card is so cute because the panda. I love it. My best friend loves pandas, so I don't know. I guess I learned to love them because she's, like, obsessed with them. I think I love them more than she does now. It's actually weird. But, okay. Ace of Pentacles energy. All right. So, new beginning, new start. We have the Queen of Cups energy, Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpio. This person really, really loves you. Okay? They really, really love you. They have a lot of love for you, whoever this person is. Okay? They want to offer a new beginning with the Ace of Pentacles, okay? So we have the Four of Swords. So they de this definitely tells me you and this person aren't talking. This definitely could be a, um, a side effect of the retrograde, okay? You guys just need to take a break, all right? So they may not be doing too much. They're literally the sleeping bear, the sleeping giant. So they're not communicating with you at this present moment in time, but they still have feelings. The Five of Pentacles, like, I get a lot of people that, like, not the five pentacles, but the queen of cups. I get a lot of people that, like, are constantly, they, like, if someone has true feelings for you, like queen of cups or king of cups feelings, that's not going to change, okay? That's never going to change, okay? Even if you guys break up because of something, you know, you're still going to love that person or they're still going to love you. Because I get a lot of readings like, they haven't talked to me in two days. Do they still love me? Two days? Are you serious? There are people who haven't talked in years go google keanu keanu reeves and sandra bullock's goddamn love story i hope they get together they need to get together damn it keanu reeves and and um and sandra bullock get it together okay i want y'all together but that's the type of love story like people don't talk for years and get back together so this person definitely loves you okay if you were ever wondering if they love you they definitely do and that's not going to change because you guys went through like a month of not talking or maybe a couple days or some of you it's not going to change we have the five of pentacles as your um their their current energy so they're definitely missing you you could be the one you could have been the one who said you didn't want to talk to them you could have been the one that said that you needed a break okay so a lot of people struggle with that and they really think love is that fickle like real love is not that fickle okay usually someone loves you they're always going to love you i don't care <laughs> If you bust their windows out, there's still love for that person. Of course, you don't want to be with them no more, but there's still love. Now, the hangman and two of wands, I'm going to take this together because I feel like this is an external factor. Um, the hangman and two of wands, we both, we, we all know, y'all watch me enough enough to know that this person definitely is stuck with the karmic by that time. If they have the hangman and two of wands. So they're still in some type of karmic relationship that hasn't ended. It could be with the Pisces um, for some of you. It could be a Libra for some of you, too, because I'm seeing four swords. I take that as sun and Libra. So it's, what's the outcome here? What's the outcome for Sag's partner? What are they going to do? What's their actions towards Sag? All right, so we have... I'm going to take the first card. Oh, hem, Emperor. Some of you are dealing with someone who is very stubborn. Okay, so even if they want to talk to you, even if they miss you, they are going through... Um, the reason why they're not coming towards you is because they're not single yet. They, they're still somebody's husband. So some of y'all are dealing with somebody's husband. Okay, they do want to um, come back and like fix things with you with the Six of Pentacles because the Five of Pentacles is here. So they do want to reconcile with you. So don't let them, even if they're being stubborn, they're being the emperor, they're not talking to you, they're not discussing their feelings, um, they're being the divine masculine, but in his negative vibration, which is someone who digs their heels in and they're very stubborn, they don't want to move. Um, they are definitely still thinking about you, Hermit Carter. They're doing a lot of soul searching. Honestly, Sagittarius, some of you could be done with a Virgo, an Aries, a Taurus, 
could be dealing with a Libra or a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. But whoever you're dealing with, you don't really want them right now anyway. I know you think you do want them, but you don't want them right now because they're still stuck in the same reason that y'all weren't talking in the first place. Life is too short to keep going through the same cycles. And what happens is for a lot of people is just to have this person, you'll keep settling. You'll keep settling for the bullshit and then they never fix it because why do I need to fix something if you're just going to keep coming back to me or if you're going to keep taking me back, okay? Now remember, this could de definitely be the Sagittarius doing this, okay? So if it resonates for the cross watcher and you're like, no, it's the Sag, then watch the video as if I'm talking to you about the Sagittarius, okay? That makes it way easier than thinking, oh, well, the Sag is doing it. Well, how would I know that? This is Sagittarius is reading, so I'm reading this for Sagittarius. Yeah, I don't know that you are done with a Sag, right? So it can be a cross-watcher thing, too. It could be the Sag that's doing this. They can be very stubborn. Sagittarians are very stubborn, okay? Um, so this could definitely be someone who's digging their hills in, but they're doing a lot of soul searching. They're really thinking about what they did. They're really thinking about the situation that they've caused that have whatever this distance is between you guys, okay? Um, they do want to reconcile with you, but honestly, they're still in this relationship here to a wand's hangman. And like I said, this is not... Now, eventually, I do see them breaking up with this person, Three of Swords. They could be with a water sign themselves, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, or they could just be a water sign um, and they're breaking up with their partner. For a lot of you, they're leaving behind a family situation or a potential family situation, meaning it was a marriage or a potential marriage. They're leaving that behind to come towards you, okay? Um, but I really feel like a lot of you are dealing with a water sign because the Queen of Cups was the first energy that came up, but... Any of the signs that you guys are dealing with, whatever it is, they want to reconcile with you, but they're not ready. The Ace of Pentacles as the first card out is a very strong card. The first card out in the spread always sets the tone of the spread, so they definitely want to be with you by 2020. They don't want to be in the same energy. They want to move things along and have a brand new beginning with you, okay? Even if they're resisting it right now. Because humans resist change, especially the emperor. The emperor don't want to change shit. He just wants to sit on his throne and look at everything that he's conquered, and he doesn't want that to change, okay? So, you know, and the emperor is known to try to juggle, you know? So let's see what this hangman of two of wands is coming up as. But this is someone who's very stubborn. Ace of Cups, yeah, see, they want a new beginning. But it may mean that someone has to follow divorce, follow divorce with the Ace of Swords or get some sort of clarity. Speak their truth. Tell this person that they're with that they don't want to be with them anymore. Lord, who else was getting this? Taurus, wasn't it? Wasn't it Taurus? You make me want to leave the one I'm with. Start a new relationship with you. This is what you do, yeah. Okay, this, y'all, y'all, yeah, it was because I think it was Taurus that had me sing at Old School Usher. So I, if you're dealing with a Taurus, you might want to watch that because this is the same thing. I was singing over there, the same damn song came to my head. So this is someone who wants to leave the one they're with and start a new relationship with you. I'm going I'm to name that, I'm going to name this video that. Um, I'm, I don't know because the Taurus going to be mad because like, why didn't you name that? whatever but this might be what this is named because this person definitely wants to leave the person that they're with and come towards you they have so many feelings for you with the queen of cups but the emperor has childhood issues most likely okay in order for you to be the emperor because the emperor can be savage like he is the earthly divine masculine so he's about conquering earthly things so this person usually has some type of daddy issues or mommy issues to where they can't express themselves fully so they have all these emotions but you probably would never know because they, they have this facade this might even be a person that deals they work in the government or they manage people um, they wear some type of uniform this could be a military person police officer whoever but they have to put on this face where they don't show this very gentle side of them but you might have saw it already you just you know it's there but they don't necessarily express that so this person they're digging in their hills and they're being stubborn right now but until they're ready to leave I feel um, a lot of you this this ending will happen in August or if not in August it could be in September because the ace of cups is a month but I definitely see a new relationship um, with you and this person but a divorce may have to be filed and that could be why there's stagnation here, okay? So even if they're not talking to you, Sag, or even if they're digging their heels in and they're being stubborn, don't don't think for a second that they don't love you or they're not wanting to come back towards you. They are, but the hangman means that they haven't fully got their karmic lesson yet. They're not ready to move on from that karmic lesson. You already did what you needed to do, so you're sitting around ready, waiting for them, Sag, but they're not ready, okay? 
so we've got keep an open mind okay so um, I definitely feel that a lot of you who are losing hope for this person and you're thinking they're not coming in I definitely feel that they are okay for those of you who don't want this person that is an omen that you could find someone else okay um, three cards came out yes yeah, some of you who want a new love there's definitely new love coming in for you but those of you who want to stay with this person you have romantic feelings and it is safe for you to love okay so I'm definitely getting these are two different energies either way if you don't want this person anymore or you're tired of waiting on this person you definitely have a soulmate coming in new love and keep an open mind this means that someone else may be coming in for you okay um, but if you still want to stay with this person they may need to know that it's safe for them to love because the emperor has a hard time trusting people as well or letting their guard down okay so it really depends on which way this is going to go do i feel like this person may reach out in august i do feel like they're going to reach out in august for those of you who are not talking to this person but let's see what this knight of swords is saying because they're going to come in with communication yeah sun card that they want to come back okay they are going to tell you that they want to come back some of you could be a leo um I don't know though because with the three of swords and the magician card they're still being a little bit stubborn here so this person is going to come back around but this is why some of you may decide you want something else because they're still giving this moon energy this three of swords energy and the five of swords so yeah they want to come in but with the sun card even here in the moon card they're still resisting yeah the magician they're resisting the divine masculine energy this is a twin flame so some of y'all are done with a twin flame and they're resisting more than just you they're resisting the divine masculine energy okay because remember i said the emperor is divine masculine energy but he's the lower vibration of divine masculine energy in my opinion this is more of the spiritual this person right here does not want to become the magician they're resisting it on all terms and levels but the sun and moon is twin and flame the divine fem divine masculine divine feminine okay so they're not just resisting you they're resisting changes altogether. they are about to get a new life and they don't want it okay and it's not just about you sagittarius this may be they have to release something that no longer serves them a family uh, of uh, like a family they created or their own family they may have to release something that they're very like um attached to okay because the emperor is about attachments all right so i hope that you guys enjoyed this reading sagittarius thank you so much for watching and please leave a comment if this resonated so i can know that these messages are resonating with you guys um and also again if you need a personal sag you know where to find me okay love you sag bye